Hi guys, hope you're all well. Today I'm out with my friend Elaine and we're going to do some photography at the Torrevieja Salt Lakes. We're going to try and capture some nice photos of the sunset, maybe get the drone up if it's not too muddy to float it off the ground. We've had a little bit of trouble finding this place but we're here now and we're going to see what kind of photos we get. The floor is very squelchy, so make sure if you do come to where either well is, like Elaine has brought, very prepared, or like hiking shoes or something like that. Ooh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, Elaine, what are you putting me through? Oh no! <laughs> oh, I'm sinking. <laughs> Yeah, this is why you need wellies. Yes. <laughs> right, I think we've got to a dry patch right next to the water. This is looking absolutely stunning. I'm gonna set up the tripods, get the cameras ready. So what settings will you be shooting in? Around about f8, if you could focus on one of those stones, that's what I'm using. My shutter speed is about a fifteenth of a second. Go to eight. Okay. Not too bad. And put your square, say, on one of these rocks. That's it. That's looking good. That's looking good. So this salt lake is usually pink and the reason it's not that pink tonight is because we have had a lot of rain recently. But the reason it is pink is because of the bacteria and the algae in the salt water. And there's usually loads of flamingos all around here. And the reason for them being pink is because of the shrimps they eat. They put a rosy coloured pink into the feather. So that's quite an interesting fact. The water is going slightly more pink now. The sun's gone down. So we might get the drone up and see what that looks like. Committed photographer right there. <laughs> Why I should have brought a pair of wellies. She's gone right out there to take some nice photos. Looks lovely. People actually used to come down here to bathe and it's actually prohibited now so you can do it at your own risk but you might get caught and you might get fined. I'm not really sure why you would want to because it's completely muddy everywhere but apparently because there's so much salt in the water you actually float so that must be quite nice. And another reason why you might want to is because the salt in the water actually has so many health benefits to your skin and to your breathing. So that's really good for you. There are actually mud baths in Marmanor where you are allowed to go in and you are allowed to put the salt and the mud on you. I have vlogged that already. If you haven't seen that, check it out. I'll leave a link up here. But there you are allowed to bathe. So that's a really nice day trip.
had a lovely time taking photos at the Torrevieja Salt Lakes. I'll leave the photos on the screen now. If you did enjoy this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Thanks for watching guys, see you next Friday. Thank you.